Hey, how you doing guys? Uh, we're going to talk, uh, finish up on the NAB 2019 in Las Vegas. Now this is, of course, it's been over for a while, but we're actually going to be talking about wireless systems. And uh, this is the one that I've used and still use, which is the Sennheiser EW100G3. And uh, it actually comes, it's fairly expensive. I think I paid uh, five or six to eight hundred dollars. Of course, I did get the kit, which includes a um, XLR adapter, which uh, the third adapter, which costs more. So um, before I get into that, I'm going to be using this as a demonstration because I don't actually have the uh, Road Wireless Go. Of course, if you subscribe to my channel, I'm getting very close to a thousand subscribers. I can finally get paid for my videos. So if you do like my videos, please sub subscribe and then uh, I can finance other things to uh, review on my channel. So I would appreciate that. Um, so we're going to actually take a look at the Wireless Go, uh, what it looks like. And of course, it is a transmitter and receiver. Now take a look at the upper left hand side at the very top, uh, the transmitter, which does utilize a built in uh, omnidirectional microphone, which I think is a great addition to this because um, working with um, my wireless system, you have to hook this uh, obviously up to the uh, transmitter pack. And it's kind of a haphazard where you got to place the uh, the microphone and then hide the cable. It's kind of a pain in the butt, but having the um, I mean, directional microphone built into it, you can actually clip it onto your shirt and you're good to go. Of course, it makes it a little bit more bulky, but of course, keep in mind the actual transmitter is much, much smaller, um, maybe even half the size or uh, a third of the size, I guess or two thirds of the size. So it's a little bit easier to hide. Um, it is based on the uh, 2.4 gigahertz uh, range. Now this is adapt, uh, it's adaptive frequency hopping for the best signal possible. So if you happen to be on a channel and it starts losing signal strength, if there's another uh, channel that's actually has uh, more higher signal strength, it'll obviously hop onto that so you're going to get the biz, uh, the best audio possible which I uh, like that idea as well uh, both packs come with a belt clip and so what I like about these belt clips is the uh, receiver um, the size is perfect you can use it on a cold shoe mount so you don't have to worry about uh, using any kind of adapter to put it on your camera which is good as well um, now the range on this is showing 70 meters line of sight. Of course, with any kind of wireless system, if you have things blocking it, such as walls and other things, uh, could affect uh, the signal strength or cut out. So obviously that's why it's the line of sight. Now I think that comes in around about the 150 foot range. I'm not good, uh, good at doing uh, math in my head. And uh, it does utilize built-in lithium-ion batteries at, at about seven hours. Um, and I think you can use a USB-C or even USB cable to recharge it as well. So I think I thought that was a very unique uh, wireless system um, at a great price point, which is why I wanted to cover this in this video. And as always, thanks for watching and see you guys later.